What's up, Styles Gang? Thank you so much for tuning in again. My name is Shay. If you're new here and if you're returning, thank you so much for watching this video. As you can see by today's title, I'm doing bum to baddie transformation, period. It was never giving bum with a natural face, but that's what we're just going to title this video. If you're interested in knowing how I achieve this beautiful, natural uh, bomb, bomb look. Well, I mean, this is a beat down, so I wouldn't say too natural, but you know, the girls that get it, get it free. If you're interested in seeing how I achieve this look, watch it to the end, okay? And I'll see you in the next one. Mwah. All right, Styles gang, here we go, right into the tutorial. Starting off with, you know, moisturizing my lips, of course, and putting my hair back. So before getting started, I like to go in with my Milani Rose Prep and Prime Serum. This can actually be found at Walmart. Um, it's only about six bucks. I'm telling y'all right now, it's a gem. If you don't already have it, have it, please go get it. Okay, and to start with the face, I'm going in with this brush I got from Amazon and my NARS uh, foundation in New Caledonia. And I'm just gonna go ahead and make a few stripes on my face. I didn't even realize that I was running out, but yeah, I guess it's time to just get a new one. Um, it's fine though, because luckily I have multiple foundations um, for like different times of the year. My skin gets a little lighter, a little darker. Um, so I went in with my MAC NW50 liquid foundation, and this is actually a gem too. It's like my literal perfect shade. Like when I tell you perfect, it's like literally perfect. So I just went in and added like a little bit on top. Um, and we're just gonna see how that kind of blends out. I wasn't really too worried about my neck because, you know, if I was like really stepping out, I would have went all in, but you know, for the sake of this video, I want you guys to see how I put a face together, honey. Now to start off that highlight, I'm going in with that LA Girl Pro Concealer in Warm Honey. Now, let me tell y'all real quick something about this concealer. This is a gem, a G-E-M, because at first, just like all the other girls, I was stuck on fawn real bad. You know, it's like the go-to shade for, you know, darker skin tones. And, you know, something just told me to go ahead and take it up a notch. I really love a bright under eye. For my contour, I'm going in with my Black Opal. Uh, I think it's a mocha shade stick. I could be wrong, but yeah, a deeper color, um, about three shades deeper than my skin is normally what you should go for when looking for a darker concealer. Now I'm using my Real Techniques blending brush to blend out those harsh edges, okay? Cause you know, you girl gotta be crisp, gotta be right. Okay, I go in when it comes to blending. One thing about it, I'm not I'm not gonna half ass my blending, okay? I'm going I'm going all the way in. I'm getting under every crack and crevice, okay? And I just learned a new blended technique too, so you know y'all y'all see me really blending. I had to cut this part short because my blending be da 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 like I <laughs> I go in, okay? Gotta get that nose right. Watch how I'm about to snatch this nose, though. Like, y'all not even ready for it. But I'm going to be quiet. I'm going to just let y'all see. What did I tell you? Didn't I tell you I was going to snatch it? Oh, okay, for real. I know I look a little funny doing this, but I had to get underneath in that crack and crevice. I told y'all I'm not playing the games. So now I'm just kind of taking that excess concealer that was on my brush and just going over my lids real quick. Then 
these days i actually don't really do too much to my brows all because i feel like the hairs have kind of uh, thinned out with what i have going on you know with my health so um the last time i was trying to like actually fill it in with a brow pencil it started to hurt it like literally hurt to fill my brow in so i just gave up <laughs> and just started using some concealer yeah my eyes started to water i was like bruh that's like the worst part about doing a makeup and your eyes start to water but one thing about that concealer and that blended technique it wasn't gonna move I'm still here. I know you missed my voice. <laughs> nah, but y'all, why my eyes kept watering though? I was sick. I'm like, bruh, I'm just trying to film this tutorial real quick. Like, can y'all just bear with me? Oh my God. Now for one of my favorite parts about this whole process, I get to go in with my Tarte Shape Team Concealer in Tan Deep Sand uh, right under my eyes for a brighter under eye. Like I told y'all before, I am a sucker for a bright under eye. And you're gonna see why at the end of this video if you keep watching. But yep, I'm just blending in that concealer that I placed right under my brows, just kind of blending it down because I'm not doing any eyeshadow. But do you see how smooth that looks? Like, if you need to zoom in, feel free to zoom in at any time in this video because everything you see is pure talent. You really just gotta blend for real, like blend to the gods, okay? Cause one thing about it, when you do a flash test, when you do, you know, your selfies and everything on that iPhone camera, that iPhone camera does not spear you at all, okay? I know y'all know what I'm talking about. When the camera just got you looking real crispy, well not even crispy, real crusty. <laughs> y'all make them not blend it right we can't be having none of that okay i'm gonna get y'all right just follow my slips i got y'all and now it's time to go ahead and set everything into place i'm going in first with my wet and wild banana powder this can also be found at walmart i believe it's about mm, six or seven dollars i think but i really like it because i feel like it doesn't give me flashback um as long as the beauty blender i'm using which should always be damp is really moist um and then i will not get flashback and this uh it does really well And now I'm going over the banana powder with some translucent powder from, I believe, oh yeah, Juvia's Place. Taking a cheek brush from my James Charles Morph set Okay, if you didn't get that set of brushes, what you doing? That brush set was pretty expensive, actually, um, but I did get it on sale, actually, in 2020. Not gonna lie to you. <laughs> I was not paying 120. That's the... Now let's bronze up the situation with our two-toned Juvia's Place Cheek Palette. I believe it's the bronzer duo. 
Um, that's the correct term, actually. My bad, Julius. Hopefully, we can partner one day. <laughs> Get a little sponsorship, sponsy, sponsy going on. Um, but no, you guys, I love Julius Place. Their uh, products are so pigmented, down to their lip care, everything. Like, they really got it going on over there. But yeah, I just kind of go in kind of heavy with my bronzer, as you can see. But I just feel like it does what it's supposed to do. And it's all going to work out in the end. So just hang in there. Being as though I have my nose piercings and also my nose runs every time I do my makeup, which is insane. But yeah, anyways, just cleaning off my piercings. Now to just set my whole face, spraying it down with that Morphe Jumbo set of spray to be correct. Yeah, Jumbo. Adding some gel liner to my waterline. I actually got really lucky and found this gel liner at the flea market for only like two bucks. I need to go back. I'm actually go back tomorrow, matter of fact. <laughs> and give me a few more because what? Inglot who? Yes, period. You cute. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so for my birthday which was december 24th yep you heard it right christmas eve i did get lash extensions okay and my girl she did what she needed to do period So I wanted to keep this look super natural, neutral. So I just went in with NYX Butter Gloss in Cinnamon Roll, I believe. Um, you see my face is a little iffy at first, cause I'm like, hmm, this is sheer. And at the time I couldn't locate my brown liner. So yeah, I just went ahead and slapped it right on. <laughs> Right in the middle of feeling myself, I looked in that mirror real close and I'm like, whoa, I see a white cast. Let me go ahead and grab my MAC, okay, foundation, and just go right over that. Go ahead and fix that problem real quick. You see that? Mm, just blend it right, right in. But I'm still not going outside, so I don't got to be perfect, perfect today. Let me get up close and personal for you guys. No filter, honey, no filter. Yes, it's given. Peep my gems on my teeth. You already know your girl bling. Dion. But thanks y'all so much for watching this video. And I will see you in the next one. Mwah.